Hey guys, it's Morgan with BDSM Relationships and Education. Thank you very much for checking out this video. Um, this is going to be a bit of an interesting one today uh, because it's a response to a comment that I got on a video that got flagged because of YouTube's new uh, policies about comments. Um, and so I am going to try to answer this question while not using the language that is a problem but still let you guys know what's going on and what I think. And um, I'm sorry for the person who asked that question, that it got flagged. Um, it's YouTube's stuff, it's not me. Uh, so I can't like, you know, specifically, I don't want to necessarily tag you or anything. Um, so I just hope that you come back to the channel and you find this response. So I'm sorry I didn't respond in the comment thread because I, I, I really want to keep my channel. Anyways, guys, <laughs> with that introduction, and it's it's not even, like, that juicy or anything, so don't get too excited there. <laughs> but with that introduction, I'm going to remind you to subscribe to my channel, uh, if you haven't done so already, and to hit the bell, uh, that way you're notified every time I post a new video. Now, the question that I got is what I think of, we'll go with people younger than myself joining the BDSM community, uh, or not necessarily joining the community, but watching my videos and things like that. Now, if you are interested in joining the, the BDSM community, um, you generally do need to be at least 18, um, some places 19, other places 21. Um, it's going to depend, so just, you know, find out ahead of time. Usually places uh, will be pretty clear about the age um, and often I mean things will be held in a bar and that will tell you uh, but you do need to be an adult to join the BDSM community um, so here's the here's the the hint of what the question was about right um, so I hope I don't get in trouble for this because it was it's an important question it is a really important question and I really wish that I didn't have to you know be silly about this stuff and 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 be so like, oh, <laughs> shh, we can't say words. Um, it's silly. So, yes, if you want to join the BDSM community, you do need to be a legal adult. Because if you are not, you put everybody there at risk. Because we are dealing with things that can be sexual situations. Adults and people who are not adults do not mix when it comes to sexual things. But if you are not a legal adult, go with that. Hopefully it's okay. How do I feel about you watching or learning or whatever? I think you should. I absolutely think you should. Um, I think you should pursue whatever it is that you find uh, interesting. I think that you should do that uh, in the most educated way possible. So whether that's watching videos here, I do my very best to keep my videos all ages. Um, some of them have been age restricted and sometimes it makes sense that they're age restricted and sometimes it really, really bothers me. I've had a couple of consent videos, um, age restricted and that really pissed me off because other people need to know about consent and how to go about it and negotiate and things like that. I think that that's really, really important information for some people to have, for everybody to have, really. Um, and so in that case, there are, I do have information on my website, which as well is, you know, open to uh, people of all ages. So because I keep things very, you know, there's no adult situation pictures or anything like that on my website. I've done that on purpose. Uh, so, uh, I think that you should explore, I, like I said, with as much education as you can possibly get. There are a lot of books that you can buy on Amazon, uh, you know, or, you know, you can get at bookstores and things like that. Like regular bookstores, not adult bookstores. Regular bookstores will sell a lot of this stuff too. Um, so hopefully you can get access to it. The internet is amazing. Like I, it was, it was in its infancy when I was not an adult. Um, and so now it's just like this amazing resource for you guys. And, and I wish it was there when I was not an adult. Um, 
but it but it wasn't so uh but yeah and as far as uh, you know yeah learn as much as you can learn everything just consume as much uh you know media and everything as you possibly can around this stuff and make sure that it's like not fantasy stories you know don't read 50 shades of gray and think of it as an instruction manual because it isn't it's just a little fantasy book um and the woman who wrote it wasn't even into this stuff so um be aware of that kind of thing um so make sure that you're learning from proper sources and absolutely explore with an age appropriate partner um again i don't think that adults and not adults mix when it comes to that kind of thing um you know it's there's too much of a power imbalance there's too much of a I mean, a legal issue, there's too much of a, it's just not right. <laughs> um, but, you know, there's other people that are age appropriate that you can explore with. Um, and I think that absolutely you should, if that's what you want, if that's what you think you're into, then go for it. Um, I think it's really important. Look, I started exploring this stuff when I was not an adult. Uh, and... It, you know, I'm not, it didn't damage me. It didn't whatever. Um, there's a lot of stuff that I, I wish I had done differently, certainly, and that I would have done differently if I had access to the information, right? This is part of why I want to make sure it's accessible to all of you guys. Uh, so, yeah, um, that that's what, that's basically my answer to the question. Um, please. Yes, watch my videos, um, learn as much as you can, uh, ask me questions, just don't mention that you're not an adult. Um, and yeah, like, I don't see a problem with it, as, again, as long as you're, you're doing that with an age-appropriate partner, or solo. I mean, there's so much stuff that you can explore just on your own, and I really think that that's a good thing to do, too, to explore on our own before you know, we, we engage with other people. Um, and again, it doesn't matter how old you are. Um, you know, we, we need to have that time of sort of self-reflection and figuring out if we're really into it or not, you know? Um, and, and just, you know, follow the advice that I've given to everybody about communication, which I know is really hard when you're still trying to figure all this stuff out. Um, but, you know, do your best with communication and, absolutely make sure you have consent like i i worry less it's funny i worry so much less about uh the people that are younger than me um because you guys have had it sort of out there and it's in your face and you've learned about consent it's people that are my age we never got taught any of this stuff um and we're the ones who seem to be having a lot of problems with it as well I'm not going to mention any names, famous people in the media right now, or any of that kind of stuff. Um, but yeah, I, I do think age-appropriate partners are really important. I'm going to stress that one. Feel free to go to my website and read my R. Kelly <laughs> uh, article. Get so many views every time he shows up in the news. But yes, um, I'm going to stop rambling now because I think I got the point across. That yes, explore. Explore in a safe way. Explore uh, in an educated way and explore with an age-appropriate partner. And uh, then when you meet sort of the threshold to come out to the BDSM community, come out and join us. Um, you know, we'd, we'd love to have you. Uh, and, you know, there's, there's nothing stopping you, you know, talking about this sort of thing with your, with your peers and with your friends. And, you know, that's, I mean, that's all we do too. We talk about it with our friends. That way we kind of have a better idea of what we want to try or what have you. But yeah, that's, that's what I have to say on that one. Um, I'm going to have to creatively edit stuff. Hopefully YouTube doesn't give me a strike or delete my channel or anything like that. But it was a really important question that I really wanted to answer. And I'm sorry that I couldn't do it in the way that it was presented to me. Um, but we've got to play within the rules here. 
So anyways, guys, thank you so much for checking this out. Um, please uh, watch what you say in the comments. I'm going to have to monitor it really, really closely uh, because there are, you know, if we are referring to people that are not adults, then even in the comments, people's channels are getting deleted, um, and especially just due to the nature of this channel. Um, but yeah, please, like, you know, if you have an opinion on it, if you don't agree with me, that's fine. Like, be respectful, but let me hear your side of things. I'm curious. Um, so yeah, if you do agree with me, great. <laughs> I always like that. But um, yeah, let me know what you guys think. Um, and just, yeah, uh, please, please don't get my channel deleted. <laughs> Anyways, guys, I'm going to leave it there. And I will see you in the next video.